Professor here yeah. with uh, the T-shirt report and with my good friend Richard Reeves, and we do the report every week if we can, and our very good friend Mark Cudre, and we've known Mark for eons. We're at uh, SGIA 2015 in Atlanta, and we've been joking on and off how many times we've been to Atlanta. This used to be, you know, you've been to the Bobbin Show here. Yes. Oh, sure. Which, which probably took up A, B, and C, right. you right. know. And the Super Show. Yes. Remember that show? That was another mm -hmm. gigantic show. Back so we're day, webcasting. Back in the day of the mega shows. Oh, they were gigantic. It was all just kind of yeah. faded away and stuff. So we're live from SGIA. And uh, we're going to be webcasting through the entire show. And Greaves and I are going to be talking to different people. But we appreciate it. I, I, uh, if I was on a plane, I'd like that. Try, try and avoid much flight. People that if they would all be somewhere really exotic. I've been to. Otherwise, no, you've been to, you know, you and I went to Russia. That's a pretty oh, cool place. And I've been you, five you, times. Oh, you're back. I never water. Oh, no. no. They, they Are they top the island? The result about that. Oh, no, I know. They just they pick you up for dark morning, work you until, like, it's about red sun come up. Yeah. You, you leave for one hour, then we pick you up. Where they put you up at? The, whatever, the, the hotel uh, in the... Uh, yeah, they, they did in, me... Uh, in, uh, Port Louis. Port Louis, yeah. yeah. Port Louis downtown, and then after that, they put me at the beach, which was great. Yeah. I could look at it from my room as they were picking me up. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Was, it is ruling. Yeah. It is ruling. Yeah. Early all night, so anyway. So what are you doing now? You're staying home a little bit. Staying home. Um, working in the bathroom, just sitting there, getting up, a little coffee, and... No, it's still working pretty hard. Yeah. Um, different kind of work. Um, right. You look, wonder of the internet now, it's amazing how much work that you can get done with Skype and um, web, you know, webinars and mm -hmm. live video and... Um, printing. I'm not, I'm not. I'm physically not printing. More. We still contract printing. Print, print, get out. Yeah, we have uh, relationships with the printers, so we yeah. are sourcing. Are you doing SEPs? I mean, I'm just oh yeah, no, but, I, 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 but I don't. If you're doing them, I, don't, I assume you weren't doing them yourself. No, uh, Tammy has been doing them. She's been with me for three. That email to me, and I'm blown away. Yeah, she's been with me three years, and yeah, we're still probably doing 100 to 150 SEPs a week. Yeah, so yeah, it's, it's very, a lot. very okay. high volume. But we've got customers that are steady, steady customers those for are years. Ones. Oh my you god! Know, and you know, we can, we can count on these guys for you know 10 to 30. Yeah, seven. love those guys. So I know guys always the guy that does never done never it. Done it before, never done it before. Never done it. The the guy laser is, writer. The best guy yeah. is your is your steady guy who gives you good art and you can do them quick because it's clean well, and quick. They, and, you know they're smart because they realize that they may be okay but we're experts. Yeah. And it's always going to be right. Yeah. You know, and there's people that you know they they specifically want to do their film you, mm -hmm. even though I've been doing this for years. Mm -hmm. I I. You know, the, as soon as they start asking for her, then I know it's time for me to step <laughs> oh. away. I need to find a Tammy. <laughs> <So>. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's funny. Is Tammy there? Yeah, stay there. I like. The I want to talk to you. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So other than that, though, you're doing a, kind of a marketing gig right. kind of and a thing. Essentially, you know, for the last 25 years, I spent 3 million miles traveling all over the world, working primarily on the technical side of businesses, helping them improve their production, and, and I, their, 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 their sales and marketing. So I started printing. Mm. So initially, Samation. Um, plop helps every bunter gather. He, he <laughs> Great, he goes. He, you know, they work on it, and work on it, and then when it's finally oh, done, they lose it. You know, they go back out and they have to do it oh all over again. Oh my god, that is so good. Never heard you use that one before. <laughs> no, that is so perfect. It's so true, though. It is so true. My god, yes. so you're kind of cut the, cut the chase on the woolly mammoth side. You're well. It it basically, I don't care if you if you want to have mammoths. Let's create a process and a pro mm -hmm. that'll allow you to bring them in. Right. So what's your called? Catalyst accelerator. All right. C A T Y. C A T A L Y S T Accelerator. Right. Dot com. The um, website is catalystplan. Dot com. Oh, right. Right. Because there, there's more than just the accelerator. Right. Accelerator is the starting point. Right. So what's your big overall view? I mean, you, you, we talked about <coughs> using uh, webinars and uh, the accelerator plan is basically an eight-week program. There's a, a webinar uh, on Tuesday with an assignment, and then on Thursday there's an open mic call in. To ask questions and figure out how you implement a program. The basis is really simple. The program is priced based on the results that we had from 65 people going through it last year. It's really simple. It's a every dollar spent for me, you're going to get a dollar back in revenue, new revenue. So if you if you give me twenty five hundred dollars, you're going to get twenty five thousand dollars of new business. In eight That's weeks. easy math, isn't it? Yeah. But the course, what's the course cost? Twenty five hundred dollars for for eight weeks. I guarantee, and I guarantee it that that if you meet the qualifications, there's a quali qualifying criteria that you have to go through. We go through a little interview process, and if I think that you're not going to be able to do it, or you're making up, you know, you're giving me a line of BS, I'm not going to take you. It's something <laughs> when you disqualify people getting into your program, Ooh. how bad they get Ooh, into it. Oh, yeah, right. Wow, I'm thinking. And, um, yeah. Mark Rudre, Mark, Mark Rudre rejected turned you. me down. <laughs> Man, a lie. Turned me down. Yeah. But you know, even if they get turned down, get free stuff that will bring them up. But the, the key thing is people that don't want to do it. You know, there's only two reasons why they're not going to do it. The first reason is they don't believe in me and my ability to do it, and it's proven mm -hmm. at this point. That's not you. Second reason is because they don't have, they don't trust themselves to do it. Yeah. They don't. They're too busy. The procrastinators. In fact, one of the questions I say in the interview is, seriously, dude, what kept you from doing this already? And they'll say, I don't have the right people. 
or I don't have System Plus, that's okay, I can deal with that. I'm a procrastinator, you know, I, I never get started. I don't, if someone tells me that, if they make excuses about their mother or their dog, they didn't turn their homework, whatever, they're not in. Mm -hmm. Those are going to be guys that are going to naggle with you oh and give you so much pain. Yeah. So I have no BS zone. <laughs> if I detect any BSery in, in the uh, interview the process, the you're out. You're the not meter, the meter's moving up. Here, right, the exactly. BS meter, so. meter moving. Yeah. And you know, because it is a guaranteed program, um, you know, I want people to be successful. Yeah. The bottom line is it's not a money for me. The $2,500 is not important. It's a commitment for them that if they're, if they're willing to commit $2,500 and the time to do it, which is only three to four hours a week. We're not talking a massive time commitment. Mm -hmm. But if they commit that money and that, that time, to, they're going to generate at least $25,000 new revenue in eight weeks. And in fact, the last groups that we went through, that eight week time frame, the average for the people that actually did the program was between 36000 and 50000 for the that eight-week period. So it was actually more than I promised them. Wow. So when's the next program? I mean, the first like next, the next one start. The next one starts uh, to the year right after January, January fourth or whatever. Yeah, jump in right. I mean, they, they, can't, they can't jump in the middle. No, they need to start at the beginning. I run four of them a year, limited to 100 people per session right. to go through it. Um, we're we're taking applications now. You can go to catalystplan.com mm. and you know sign it. You can give me your email address. You really want to do that, even if you don't get into the program, but you get additional information or you will help you. It's not spammy or anything like that. So the the sole purpose of Catalyst is to accelerate people's profitability because we we really have to do that. Yeah, yeah, we absolutely have. We to. talked earlier about you said that the venture capital guys have discovered this industry, right? And they're kind of gobbling it up. And you see it with Custom Inc. and Teespring, and you look at all these guys that are proud of that. You see them, they're the, the, the news thing and wherever you know, Custom Inc. gets fifty million dollars, and Wall Street Journal, and you go, really? You would think they wouldn't need that, though. I'm just that kind of thinking. I'm probably old school. Who, well, who needs their money? I'm making it already. They need money for marketing because they're running television ads. Well, they're, run, they're running radio ads. Oh, they're they're in syndicated media everywhere. They're magazines everywhere, field and street. Yeah, you see them all the time. Everywhere. So see, they, in Bowling Green, I see you go, what's the ad for El Custom Inc.? Well, you are. So the whole thing about venture capital is to disrupt the industry that they're in. They did with video, with Netflix. When was the last time you saw an independent video store owner, mm. right? They're all gone. R record stores are all gone. Digital film is all gone with cameras that went digital. Now it's t-shirts. So we're the next ones that are in there. We, we are the, the biggest underserved multi-billion dollar industry out there. It was like, mm. oh my God, how do we miss this? And once <laughs> they figured it out, they came in with a vengeance. See, we're on the industry, so we're close to it. Those That's guys the are the, they're the fresh eyes. That's the problem. Is the disruptors, they're not about making profit. That's the key thing. They're not about making profit. They're about migrating customers onto their new model, putting all the independent businesses out of business for competition, and jacking prices up when they've got no other alternatives. Ah. So for us, we need to get our, our independent people as profitable as fast as we can so that they can compete. And most important, the marketing methods are designed specifically to increase their relationship with their customers and get them to looking at customers as lifetime relationships, mm -hmm. not one-offs. The venture capital people are all about one-off relationships. Yeah. We're all. This is all about ongoing relationships, wh which is where the long-term profitability is. You would talk pre-show about the uh, analogy of the first, the first, the customer, the first guy you get. Right. If you just have him and, and you lose him, what's the profits? And if you keep him for so many years, what's right. the profitability? Harvard Business Billions in, in crime trees, nine different ads was online. So hundred dollars. It's enormous. Yeah. And the thing that shocked me is it came from five different areas, mm -hmm. which I thought it would come from like one or two, but from five different areas. Referrals were two percent. The mm. vast majority of gain came from other areas. Yeah. It's I just amazing. I teach, and I teach all of this stuff in the Catalyst program. Yeah, yeah. We, we, you talk about having all the parts of the pie together, right. and that you may be the best screen maker in the world, or you may be the best printer in the world, but so many people fail in business because they didn't know business, or right. they didn't know marketing and sales. Right. And Richard, that's an awesome point because that's the whole idea behind the long-term view of the Catalyst plan. The, the accelerator is to prove that people that, to themselves that they do this, and then they can go into our one-year programs, and our one-year program is designed to add a quarter million, half million, even a million dollars a year additional revenue to the companies. And then mm -hmm. once they get their, their sales and marketing, service delivery, and administrative parts of their business in balance, then we can drive that company up. because. We're older now. We're, we're baby boomers that are getting ready to retire at some point, right? Sure. The reality of life is we're, we're all at stage now. There are a ton of people in our industry that have got business that they thought their kids were going to take over, but the kids don't businesses. Kids don't and so now they're faced with, how do I get out? Catalyst plan is their exit strategy because it raises the multiples and it makes their business attractive for acquisition by investor. Ah. Right? That's the long-term view of this. Not just the immediate. The immediate accelerators to show them and prove to them that you can generate profits like they've never seen before and growth like they've never seen before, but that's just the beginning of a much, much bigger picture. And once they 
they graduate course? Well, they ascend. This it's, isn't a college. It's a, no, it's an it's ascension model. So basically, you can ascend to a level that you want. Most of most of the people that are in the Catalyst Accelerator start off at, in the half million to million dollar range. They've got right. one automatic. Yeah. They're struggling. They've got peaks and valleys. They don't have any systems in place. People that are seeing the biggest gains right now are the $2 million to $5 million range. And once they get to a million, the next goal from there is to have them um, acquire other companies in their region. Mm. Um, and build them with the catalyst process so that they go from five million to ten million in two to three years. Mm -hmm. And once you're at ten million, that becomes a very attractive um, acquisition point for uh, private equity. You're going to a quality investor on a ten million dollar company never oh, get on a five sure. million dollar yeah, company. Yeah, yeah, definitely. So, so that's the big. Goal. So All right, are you are you aiming at custom decorators or contract printers? Uh, it's open to anybody. In fact, it's even open to people outside of our industry. So if, if you're a great, you've got a customer that is a two million, three million dollar business, bring to the accelerator with you. Benefit. I've got instead of contract. Oh, this, I've advised not to go on printing. So, well, contract not really what's the toughest hard part. You numbs, but you're your widget. It all sounds sexy. I, my students, it's gonna sound sexy. Oh, that's that's the one. Any of us that have been there to go. Yeah. Sure. Because when I was actually major to print, right. so I heard it in my bed. Uh, is it level? Not level. Sure. When they ascend, well, the, the next level that is a three day intensive. And during that three-day intensive an off-site deal, that they fly in. I do them in different cities. We go into a hotel room, and we create a very three-day strategy session where we literally build their entire business for the next year. And then we follow them over the course of that next year. Mm -hmm. They can do it on their own, or they can um, they can do one of our coaching programs, which are one-year coaching programs, where we we facilitate and hold them accountable for their performance. Uh, we had one of our first uh, companies this, just this last weekend, it was from January of this year until um, October 31st. On October 31st, crossed their one million dollar year-over-year improvement in 10 months. Wow! Ooh, wow! And they had, they had, we started from scratch with them in January. I am really impressed. Yeah, it's very, and it's, these are universal practices. So it's not yeah. just decorated for us. It's like for independent business. It's solid as a rock. You know me. There's people behind this, mm -hmm. right? And the math is solid. There's solid statistics. This isn't all me. This is stuff that I've poured over the business areas, the case study, the best management practices from many different industries. And I've distilled over 50 different areas that Catalyst members can pull from to grow their business. I'm impressed. It's I, I was surprised you were doing it. I mean, I knew you were doing something because Green's yeah. not talking. I think he's talking more than I have in the last year, but I'm, I'm blown away. So we, we so hopefully we're going to uh, see some people here, and uh, we always enjoy seeing you. Yeah. You know, seeing you always here. something. <laughs> Mark. All right. Tell us you saw it on the T report. <laughs> it's good to hear it here <laughs> first. <laughs> The T-shirt report. We're webcasting live from Atlanta, Greaves, Fresno, Coudre, and uh, the, the 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 three of those. Huh? I hope so. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Mark, you much for joining. Thanks, bye -bye. guys. Bye bye. If we didn't get it, I didn't. <laughs>